12, but our webinar here is for 12 to 1216. Now, we're in webinar 432. I hadn't realized we had done that many webinars, but uh, as I continue to go through each day, I mean, we're doing three or four different webinars a day uh, throughout different series, different things that we do. So this is sort of company wide. Um, but we do these three days a week, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Sometimes we might skip a Friday depending on where the workload is, and we'll try to let everybody know. So we do apologize. I think we did skip last Friday. Um, but we've been in a constant flux of growth and evolution, which has just been so beautiful. And it's thanks to, in very large part, to all of you. Okay, so before we get started, I want you to give yourself a round of applause because you guys rock. Just getting through some of the things you got to get through to learn the systems, to be a part. You're making very big decisions in your life. And I want to kind of go through some of that today um, and get you started with an, an understanding of where we're going to go with uh, this company, with your trading life, and what you could be, be doing in a very short period of time. Let's get started. What are we going to talk about today? We're going to talk about some great news. This is going to be a little graphic of uh, several different things that are happening that you all will be very happy with. Uh, intraday scale and news. These are about the intraday signals. A daily shift and working it. This will be a little bit about the uh, daily system uh, and daily signals. We're going to get into a little bit different version of risk. We call risk money management. <laughs> you know, we kind of compiled it all together uh, to do it. And then I'll throw in some final thoughts. And that should take us about 45 minutes in. So don't don't overthink it too much. Just sit back and relax. You can watch this a few times. It will be up in uh, our on our youtube channel if you have not done so yet please go and like and subscribe to us on our youtube channel um every new person that's on there also gets that uh, authority out there and lets youtube know that we're doing good and we're getting a lot of people so please 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 like us on our or subscribe to our youtube channel you go to the front page right at the top there's a little youtube button there like us on facebook follow us on twitter do everything you possibly can to engross yourself into this product and who we are because we're doing the same thing for you. All right, let's get started. Before we do, because during this webinar, I am going to be talking about money and am going to be showing you some results of different things that we're doing. Um, so you would have to know that there's risk in everything that we do. Now your earning potential may not be the same as somebody else's. So the last, last little line here, all results may vary, is very important for you to understand. Okay, this is not guaranteed results for every single person. Every one of you has a different way of trading. There's 50 million different trading styles and systems and ways to do things. So just keep that in mind as you're going through. All right. The people that I'm going to show you are not just about myself because you can expect the owner to, to know how to do this stuff. But I want to show you stuff from other customers and other things that we're doing so you can see that it is being done. Okay, let's get started. Great news. The Dex Trader system. Okay, we were just, there's the only time we're going to talk about Dex Trader here in this part, uh, but the Dex Trader system is an alpha, which means that I've released it out to a few people to kind of test some of the beginning parameters. And what we did is that, you know, ultimately enough, the system will be in one, it'll all be in one system, right? So you'll, you'll just, it'll all be clickable in one little box. Um, we call an app, right? This will be an app. Yeah, that's right. It's going to be, it's right now, it's a web app. Right. And that web app is certainly going to turn into a tab app. Right. Tabulet. A tablet. <laughs> a tablet. A tablet app. <laughs> and then of course, we'll eventually, hopefully, maybe one day, if I'm asked really, really nicely, to make it a phone app. That's right. You'll be able to take signals and do all that stuff right on your phone. Yeah, I know. Sick, right? Okay. So, but for right now, it's just simply a web app. And in the web app, I've broken it down to three parts. Of course, the charts, the signals, okay, that'll be down here, and then the uh, API, or the API, the DPC. This is the Data Processing Center, and holy crap, is it awesome. Um, let me get over to it and show you what it looks like. There it is right there. Let me get over here and show you what it looks like. Okay, so you've probably seen some of this, a little version of this, but uh, I wanted to kind of show you just real quickly. Um, this is more, like we said, in the very first version of this is going to be more as a 
glorified access for deck signals, right? And so why would you want to have deck signals and deck trader if they do the same thing? Well, because the potential behind the deck trader process um, of being able to go through uh, these charts are static right now. I mean, they're real, they're live charts. You can use them, you can put indicators on them, you can do whatever you do to verify and you know confirm the direction of signals and you know double deck, you know, double check your process and all that stuff. And it uses the same signal base as we do over at at uh, deck signals, but the process of growth here, each one of these things is in its own little section uh, right now being tested because I didn't want to compile them all together until we were absolutely sure they all worked. Um, and our new signal system, which I'll talk about here in just a minute, is, is coming out as well. Now, the new signal delivery process is going to be more, because right now it's all being done in a, in a spreadsheet. So you get one person who visualizes a spreadsheet, calculations happen once a minute, so that means that person, if they're on, it happens 60 times an hour, right? So you get two people, that's 122, 120 times an hour. You get 1,000 people on. You see where this is going? So we're making a system that's more, um, it, it, it's easier to see the signal and hear the signal and get and do things with that signal now, now that we're using some of the other coding structures that we're going to be using. Um, so the signal might change in the way it looks just a little bit. Uh, but the usage, the quickness, the delivery, availability of where to send it, all that stuff is going to be uh, all done within the coding structure that will be on page. Now, the big one, right? Because before, how did you sort information? You would just come here and say, all right, I just want to know what the audio SD. Let me see what the buys do, right? Uh, how much is the uh, average pip? You know, you're kind of looking at it right now. Maybe you're under 20 pips, right? But watch this. Now, if you go to the DPC, <laughs> This is what's going to happen inside the system and it'll all sort of have like this kind of feel later on like all the buttons and everything else this is a particular type of uh web language that we're going to be using um and so when you first get here you're like holy crap this is this is a lot of information right it's the daily signal totals it's the best assets out of the dailies look at the auto gpys is clean in house it's swept it for lifetime yearly monthly boy that's that's kick ass to know right that the audi gpy is the most successful one out of it right so that's pretty pretty amazing, right? And then you can kind of break it down per asset, knowing what's the lifetime success rate of that asset. And guess what happens when you click on one? Oh yeah, that's what happens. I did switch this over, right? I better, you guys would kill me if I didn't. But the idea here is, is that the system is to tell you the information you really need. Like if you're on the daily results, you know, and you want to know you know, can I choke up? Is it a good thing to choke up? Well, when the pip average is above 40 pips on a daily on the audit JPY, that means you can come up almost two strikes and still be pretty close. One strike for almost damn sure you could possibly do with a high rate of success. Other things, it'll tell you which session trades the best. I will work on getting the other sessions uh, success rates in there. So you can see maybe there's another one that might be close to it that might fit better for you. But to know just right now that the best session is London. So if you're trading in London, then you know you got a good rate share going on. But the best hours, so which ones, and we will get the hour rates all done as well. Uh, but again, we started out with some very basic information just so we can get it working. Don't want to overload the system. Uh, and then the worst hour, of course, this is, you know, what is this for? It's like, so you know that if it's three o'clock in the morning, you're trading the Audi JPY, it's never one <laughs> at three o'clock in the morning, right? So uh, you can always keep that in mind as you're building up. As you're, as you're doing the trades. Uh, the intraday information is going to be there too. Um, very powerful, very easy to use, very easy on the eyes, you know, on what works, what doesn't work, gives you the last little bit of daily information too of, you know, which ones work the best in the last day. You know, here's the intraday information, you know. Um, so, so, so pretty powerful, right? Everybody can agree that this is, this is a system we've built this off of off of all the information we're getting from everybody else, right? So you got to see that that's that's a that's a that's a is that is the time GMT? No, everything is EST. Everything is uh, in that in that system um, for that process. Um, but what we have coming with the DPC, we have the DPC, we have the signal based system that's coming on board, which is pretty cool. Um, Teaching in the Dex Trader system is going to be a, a little bit different value than what we have here, right? Um, 
the process of when somebody comes in and buys into the network right now for deck signals is that most of the time they go straight for signals right they don't even bother looking at some of the orientation maybe some of you have done this right and then you pick up the phone or you write into chat you're like hey listen i just had a quick question um why do the sick and like we could tell you right at that point go do some training go do the orientation right and we even took orientation and made it that you couldn't go into any other training until you did the orientation right so you had to have the orientation to do the training. But now in Dex, Dex Trader, we're going to have to have it where you can't go to signals page, okay, until you go, you can't go to signals until you go to training. Right? You can't even go to anything else until you've done the training and pass the training. It's going to ask you some questions at the end. Yes, there's a quiz. It's so simple. It's so simple. It's just asking you if it, if you, if you understand what the training is, you just, okay, this is going to help us alleviate. Because listen, we want a thousand people in this system. Can you imagine answering all the rudimentary questions of every single person that comes to the system every single day? Amy and Brian have done such a wonderful job. We would have to man people 24-7 just to answer all those rudimentary questions. It is exhausting. You, some of you that are, that are senior traders have probably seen this in the chat room. They pop in that chat. They're not even going to be able to go to chat. Okay, they can't go to anything. It's going to say you're restricted until you go through training. Go to training. Quit messing around. Go to training. <laughs> you know, so that's what we're building out in that system in there. Um, it will have a chat system. It will have. Now, listen, some of you have seen the video that I put out about what the different systems are, right? So we know right now that that Dex Trader, okay, and Dex Signals, and DEX indicators. These are three main systems, right? So DEX indicators is really for those people that just want to learn the indicators, learn how to trade, learn how to be elite, learn to get to senior, do all that stuff. And you're doing so with the bare bones tools. You're getting and fighting for it, right? And you can choose then, all right, because we have we have a we have a sit we have a statement here. Learn to make it before you make it easy, okay? Learn how to do it before you try to make it easy. Basically, that's what it comes down to. And if you're not the type of person to be able to do this, that's okay. We give you a version of that, a little hybrid of signals and learning some of the conf confirming and that kind of stuff, right? So you basically, you get the signals, you get a little help there, you get to learn a little bit more, you get to ease in the indicators. There's a little bit of, a chart value there that you can learn with MetaTrader and downloading software and that stuff. But let's just say, now please bear with me. We have a statement and uh, a name that we call some of the people that really just don't have a lot of time to trade, but they really just want something to trade with, and they call them a button pusher, right? Because you want, a, I want to go in and I want to push a button and I want to make a trade, right? Or I want to, I want, I want, give me my signal and it'll tell me exactly what to go get. I push a button and I get my trade. Right, we call them button pushers, Not, but it's a term of, of endearment in a way, almost, right? Because in the very beginning, I was very against trying to make systems for people like that because some people become very lazy with that process, and I didn't want to promote lazy at that point. I wanted to be able to have a system that I could give people the the worth and the time that they needed to really work it and make it. You know, teach somebody to fish, not give them a fish, right? But I know giving people fishes needs to happen every once in a while. And so I have my system that we can work on so I, we can go through and filter out those people that just want to button push, right? Because Dex Signals is not really totally a button push. It's sort of a mix between. But now making Dex Trader has become that button push system. And this is for those people. Now, why would I cater to that if I said before I didn't want to cater to those people? Well, it's because they still want to trade. They still want to do something. They, they're they stuck in doing their job, right? And it's tough for them because maybe they got full-time kids. They, I've talked to hundreds of people. And I ask them, well, why do you want a system like that? And for those that are just like, I just don't, I just don't want to bother to trade. I just want to get the most out of it. Just give me a button. I want to push. I want to make some money. I don't really care for those people, okay? But those people that really want to make a difference in their life, do full-time trading, maybe they start out at DEX and then graduate to DEX Signals and then go over to DEX Trader. Maybe they reverse this process a little bit. 
you know, because now here they've made some money and they could take the extra time off or take some vacation or, or do whatever. Or maybe they just love their job, but they also want to trade to make supplemental income. It's powerful, right? Can you push the button for me, Max? Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's Max Dex Trader Signal Indicator.com. <laughs> Max, Max comes to your house and trades for you. Dot com. I don't, I don't know what that system would look like, right? It'd be terrible. Yeah. All right. So basically, you know, we've created this whole process. <laughs> Me too. A thousand dollars a month. I'll do it for you for a thousand bucks a month. But it'll be a cardboard cutout with a finger that bends over every once in a while and pushes the button for you. Um, but we've devised this growth pattern with us with here at, at the DEX family of trading systems and, and our city investments. And it is because we have great customers like you. So at any time, as you're going through this, you can decide that, hey, maybe I want to wait for DEX Trader, or maybe I want to really immerse myself in this, maybe take over to indicators. We're, we're open to anything for you, okay? So just keep that in mind. Plus, there's so much coming out over, the, over now and in the holidays. And we'll talk about some of that here in a minute um, in the final thoughts. But there is... Uh, so much process about to happen that my my big suggestion is surround yourself with learning and training and the other traders that are here, the senior traders, you see senior trader by their name, that means they put their time in. They've done their three or 400 trades. They've worked their ass off to get where they're at. And I'm proud to call them associates and friends and family. Okay. And to earn yourself to get to that point doesn't take very much, but it does take the dedication. It takes integrity, it takes honesty, it takes drive. If you don't have that, that's okay. We have systems for you. But eventually, to, to earn yourself into those lines, you will have to kind of go through that process. There's no button push for elites and seniors. There's no elite button pusher. There's no elite status for DEX, trader, anything. Okay? That just becomes a tool. Right? And there's some traders, there's some senior traders that graduate to that, you know, and that's okay. But they, they know now, you know, they know some of the things that they need to know. That if stuff starts to fall apart, where they can go, right? Okay, good. Now, Dex indicators and training for traders' mind. We're sort of uh, we're taking that system for five-minute training, and we're going to make it available for people in a very special format over at Dex Signals too. Um, we're going to sort of revamp that over the next three weeks, um, even the next fast than that with Dex Traders Mind, um, because we have found such success in training people with those five minutes process over DEX indicators, that it has to be something that if you want to go to elite and go to uh, senior, you have to go through that program and submit all your stuff uh, into a journal um, to us to prove that you have done it. Those kind of things, Michael, Paul, and a handful of other people that are here right now can actually explain to you why that is so important to go through. The level of experience you just get just doing 200 trades, 300 trades, 400 trades in five minutes, it's going to blow your mind, okay? Um, also, great news. We made data our bitch. Yeah, we did. I made a deal with a, a small, a very small data company. And I wrote some software for them. We built, we built some programs for them, you know, for security-wise, because we're always getting hit, right? Because we, we got, we came very good at security. And, I, you know, I put this on my Facebook page the other day, is that every time... Diversity came or adversity came to you. You know, you ran and hid until somebody figured it out for you. You'd be in a corner all day. That's how I feel, right? Somebody tells me I can't do something. Somebody, someone tries to take advantage of me. I either try to figure it out or I'll make the thing. If I don't need it, I'll completely ignore it. But we needed data to fill all this stuff. And you have all these big companies, you know, these big, huge companies that supply data that the moment they find out what we're doing, man, they want to add on that price tag. So what did we do? I won't call it dexdata.com or anything. We're not going to make a business profile out of it. But we did make a relationship with a data company. And in train, we, we partnered up with them and done so with this economics company to be able to get the data at such, I mean, it's, it's like 50 bucks. It cost me 50 bucks a month. You know, and it's only because I'd given them a server to house their website on. <laughs> And so we can, so I traded, I traded services and we went into business together. It was incredible. We don't got to give them any proceeds of the company or nothing. We, we just, I gave, I built them a website and a security network and a process. And then they in turn gave us the data and the availability to make our own data company. So 
Dex data is is now going to be a thing. Yes, it will be a thing. Isn't that wild? And I, I say it is because it's absolutely wonderful. And we wouldn't have made those relationships. We wouldn't have made those things unless we were building and growing. And it's all because of you guys. Right? So just for a second, pretend you're not on a webinar that's teaching you how to trade. Pretend you're on a investment portfolio uh, information webinar. And you, as many investors into this company, what you're getting from it. Can you imagine? Change your mentality just for a second and listen to somebody who just told you in 1.5 years we built DEX signals, DEX indicators, and now DEX trader at the end of the one and a half years, right? DEX indicators is only 1.5 months old. DEX trader is not even fin fully finished born yet, right? And all of this. It's worth more than $1.8 million at the moment. That's right. With the amount of people that we have coming in, with the amount of solution that we have, we've been assessed at $1.8 million as a company. Talk about transparency. Talk about wanting to be a part of something big. That's after 1.5 years. Imagine when we hit our third year with all of you. Imagine the money that you're making while you're learning the process, the new people that are coming. We're now showing live proof that's happening in our networks, in our solutions, from trades that we're doing with our traders themselves. So pretty powerful. Hang on. Sorry, had a very bad sneeze hit me all of a sudden. Okay, now let's shift let's shift the, the, the mentality here just a little bit. We're going to head back over to uh, the mentality of trading, right? Okay, so you know we're a big company. You know we're doing some some great stuff, um, and we're growing. So you know that it's real, right? So, but let's jump back just to a little bit. Here, about a week or two ago, we came out back out with the intraday signals again. Uh, actually, a little bit longer than that, uh, and we created a rule pack that says, you know, the main rules: no news, trade one at a time, choose the highest success rate. Um, you know, news restriction and add-ons coming, right? But the scale that most of you need to understand is that this is not about putting 50, 60 trades on a day, right? That kind of mentality. Is there anybody here who, who feels that they need to do 50, 60, 70 trades a day? Can anybody tell me in the room here, and if you're watching this after the fact, put it in your mind too. What is a number for you? What is a number? Put a number in your mind. Put a number in the chat room for everybody that's here right now. Put a number that you need that you need to think that you need to, to do a day. John says way less than 10. Uh, Shawana says 15. Dan says one. <laughs> hey, Dan, you're, you're right in my mentality, man. Jim says five. There you go. Five's a good number, too. Anybody else have a number in their head? Michael says he pleads the fifth, the fifth trade. All right. Well, what you need and what you want are always suspect to be two different things. But let me tell you right now, what you really need to focus on is making five to ten really good trades a day. Right? That's it. If you make less, that's fine. Okay? But what's the most important thing about making the trades is the one in that equation, the C that we always talk about, right? Out of CVG, consistency plus volume equals goal. That's all you really care about. If you only make two a day and you're winning those 95% of the time, then you're only doing, you're working four days a week and you're doing eight trades a week. And if you only traded one contract, you're winning about, what is that? 160 bucks, right? Doesn't seem like a lot, right? But then you apply the algorithm and you do two contracts and now you got 320. You do 10 contracts, you have 1600. This is for the week. Are you folks seeing it? So your mentality shift of how much you need in a day matters only on one other variable. Can anybody tell me what it is? 
Does anybody tell me what it is? That is the most important number. No, not volume. Consistency first. Remember, that's why it says consistency plus volume, not volume plus consistency. Because the idea of reaching consistency first is your most important value out of any equation of anything that we have. Consistency is your biggest concern and should be in the very beginning your only concern. Now, this is not just consistency in the signal, but consistency in what you do to derive to that signal, okay? And your winning ratio. If you break a rule and you lose, guess what? You're breaking your consistency margin. You're basically starting yourself over. Can you imagine building a castle with bricks? And if you misplace one brick, you could break them all. Doesn't seem like a, 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 a profitable system at that point. But what I'm teaching you is that if you follow the rules, okay, you don't create weak chains along the way, you will become very profitable in this, in this solution for yourself. But I can't combat those things that happen in your life, right? Things get in the way. Mistakes happen. You have to be able to remove those quickly from your mind mindset. Because a lot of what affects this algorithm or equation from being successful, it all has to do with three other letters. Got it? Good. Daily signals. Let's talk about a pet peeve of mine. How many of you here use the daily signals? Come on, be honest. So that's okay. It's all good. Pat you on the head. Daily signals is like the old person. <laughs> they are boring as all get out. Rich Arnold says they're hard to get filled. Yeah, they are. They are hard to get filled. Yay. Somebody got it. Thank you very much. They're hard to get filled. But anything good is hard to get filled. Okay, you ready for some more numbers? Okay, here's some more numbers. Rich Arnold, how many, how, what percentage, what percentage do you feel of them getting filled is an acceptable percentage? Fifty percent. Okay, that's a number that just kind of got pulled out of the air because what's what's a good what's a good number for anybody right so here here's something that i did last week and this is this is the procurement of what dailies are right why did i place how did i place 14. i want you to before i can tell you this you need to know just a little bit about me in a way okay I am a I am a I am a trader. I'm a, I'm, a, I, I'm considered in certain circles. Okay, maybe some people would say I'm a master trader. Okay, but let's just say I'm at the top of my game. Okay, now if I'm trading, if I sit down in a session and I trade four hours, right during this block in this four hour block, there are roughly anywhere between twenty to thirty signs that come out per day. If I'm trading this time period, if this was my life, if I'm only trading four hours, let's just say if, even if I'm trading eight hours, if I'm doing this full time, okay? If I, if I sit down and do this, how many am I doing a week at this point, right? So I'm doing about 60, 60 I can see 60 signals come over in my box in an eight hour day per day, right? So if I see about, if I see this process happen, okay? If I'm sitting down all day long, in my eight hour chair and I see 60 signals come over and right now the ratio of fulfillment from what I see personally is between 20 and 30 percent but let's just say it's the low number that I showed you there the 21 percent right what's that percentage 60 times 0.21 right so about 12 contracts let's see it's, it's above the so let's say 13 contracts get filled, 13 contracts. 
okay? So 13, tra 13 trades get filled, not contracts trades. So if I sit down for an eight hour period and only fill 20%, How many am I getting? 13 a day? If I sit down here, my four hour, okay, and I'm only doing about seeing between 20 and 30, even at 21%, I'm still filling about four. How many do we need to fill in a day? I think we were talking about just a few screens ago. Do you get the point? That's why I put it in the graphic after this one. What is your workload at this point? They are boring. They are, you can't, you can't sit. I mean, if you have a very minimum balance, you have to kind of take in consideration because with Nadex, they pull a reserve out for the trade. So it's, if, if you don't have a big enough balance, you can't put on 10 at once. Okay, I can put on four or five at once and, and not feel the pain there. Okay, because I have a very high, high balance in mind. On my, on my other account that I have, okay, that's my personal account, I have a very low balance in there. So I only do one or two. I go after the one that I know will somewhat fill. And I take my, I take my chances. This is why the 14 filled. Okay, out of the 14, only three of them filled. But because I did it with 10 contracts on each one, I did pretty hella good for the week. Right? I made $614 for the week. Now, I had 10 contracts on there. And in one base, that may not seem like a lot of money to some people for a week's worth of work. But I didn't do this. I wasn't sitting down like this. Right? I'm only sitting down for trading for one hour a day when I'm trading daily. I'm looking for a specific, specific, particular time. I sit down at my 8.15, 8 to, 8 to, 8 to 9 o'clock. And I wait for the dailies to come out at that point. And if I see one that I feels good, I put put it on. You understand? So my eight o'clock to eleven o'clock at night, that's what I'm doing. I'm sitting filling out. If I fill one in, I fill it in. If it's only two or three, it's only two or three that get filled for the week. I have no motion at why? Because they're filling at ninety five plus percent. Oops, hang on a second. Okay, let me show you this. Daily results. 95 plus. This is over a lifetime. Look at this is last month. Now we now we do a breakdown. 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 Okay. 100 percent 100 percent Over a week. 100 percent 100 percent 100 percent 100 percent 100 percent 100 percent It's sick. Over last month. Look at this. There's no 100 percent total over the year or lifetime, because we, it hasn't been active fully one year yet with this new system. But more than more than eight, nine months right now, 7,127 trades. Okay. So you look at it. Right? The week is new, so there's only two, but last month, so the week is new, all right? So keep, this is over the last, uh, this is for this particular week so far. So as it's filling out, it propagates, but we'll see. But the solution is right in front of you. Now, how do you get, oh, screen, crap, L, crap, oh, crap, crap, fuck, crap, excuse me. All right, let's do it again, just real quick. Here we go. It's 95.2, 100%, 100%, This is the daily, this is the daily string. I don't want to do it yet. Right? But 7,127 signals on the dailies. So that's not too, that's not too, right? So even though that Rich is right, they don't get filled a tremendous amount. Of course, yeah, they're held to expiry. Thomas, with a success rate of percent, why would you touch it? You trying to improve it? 
I asked a customer two days ago, actually on Friday, a little frustrating when he said that he needed to be able to improve it a little bit more and he's, and he's batting 91%. There's no reason for it. You know, if you're going to scalp, you got to scalp on wins and losses. You got to know how to do both. Not just when, when it's super green for you. But yeah, hell to expiry. Why not? At 95% success rate when it does fill, I just go to bed. I fill my, I put my contracts in the bottom, boom, 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 the ones that I want. And I go to bed. When I wake up, if they fill, very high success rate. If I'm not trading during any news, if I'm not putting news factor in there, put them on. But listen, even with the fact of trading news, that system trades through the news. Trade trade through it. Still has the same percentage. There's no filtering system in there for news for the dailies. I'm pretty sure that if I took the ones out that were news oriented, I got beat up over news, like for the NFPs and things like that, the win rate would be even higher. So the success of this fulfilling makes no difference whatsoever because that number and the amount of signals that come out. Because if you asked yourself back at this screen, when we were when we were talking about how many signals do you need? How many trades do you need to do today? And you didn't say 50? You know, 50 trades, 60 trades a day? You know, if you only said four or five, well, the dailies just gave you that. And that's only putting on working orders. You realize that, right? I'm just talking about working orders right at the moment. You want to get into the mix of it. Start talking about choke-ups. That's what I did the other night on my other account. I just go in and second most asked question in chat, what's a WO? Working order. Working order. So number one answer. <laughs> we could play it. What is a working order? A WO. Yes. Score. Off to Jeopardy I go. But to be able to follow that process, to go through the training, learn how to put the working orders on, know how to get in, know how to get out, know what your trades look like, what the working order does, how to place the working order, what number to put on the working order, if it's a buy or a sell, all of it's in there. If I were you and I was demoing whether or not it took you a lot and you and Imagine like you only have ten thousand dollars in them because that's where you basically. And I'm going to show you that here in risk management, money management stuff. But the idea here is is get yourself to trade like you trade live. And trading in working orders is going to get your 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 safe money is your safest money possible. Your intradays are your next level, but you got to be very careful. There's more opportunity to win because you're you have more trades to get into. But what happens when you touch the market more and more and more and more? Chance of risk is lost, right? Now, what you do with that loss sets you apart from a novice trader to a winning trader. Why? Because if you're in there trading, okay, and you need to be at like 85% plus to be at a profitable number every month, then... In order for you to get in there, you have to, there's just going to be times you're going to lose. But it's not a perfect process. You don't, I just traded 10, but I lost three. So that's 70%. This is a failing system. No. We had a customer call in uh, very, very upset. I just did some five-minute trades and I lost my first one. This system doesn't work. I need, to, I need to win nine in a row now. No. Why do you need to win nine in a row? In order to get to that 90% everybody's talking about, you know, you still need to do 99 more trades. You can try to figure that 200 trades, 300 trades, 400 trades, then come back and tell me that it doesn't work. All right. So speaking of which, let's talk about some risk man, the, the risk money management, right? We kind of, this was a faux pas when I first did it a couple of weeks ago, but I, I'm sort of running with it because it works. Okay. Let's just get real for a moment. Risk. Let's talk about risk. What the hell are you risking? Okay. Some of you are like, well, I got to pay for this system. Well, no, really? Yes, you do. It's like a tool, it's like going to school. 
when you get that high paying job, some of you ever have a high paying job? Some of you ever have, some of you have a profession, maybe a vocation. Some of you gone through apprenticeship. When you were going through all your apprenticeship stuff, yes, you were getting paid at certain times, certain things. But when you were going to high school, you never once said to your teachers, I really hope this whole high school thing works out because this is a big risk for me. Because in order for me to be a doctor, <laughs> I need to make sure it works out. You never counted your book money as part of your investment into it. It always just became a tool. That's what this is, this company, this system. Does it have an investment portfolio? Yes. Are you investing in our future while investing into your own? Absolutely. It's like going to school and paying dues or whatever from a private school and you're and you're paying your the school's paying you, your parents are paying dues or whatever and that money paying out for the football stuff and everything's analogy is really sucking at the moment but hey you get the you get the gist here the monies you put to us do i get some of it absolutely does the staff get some of it absolutely but the majority of it goes to building the things that you see that we're building and this is what creates a company that does care about the people that it is serving. I'm not here just to line my pockets. You know, my pockets get lined with all the money I make from trading. My hard work lines my pockets. I'm not stealing anybody's money. I'm not scamming anybody out of a process. I'm not lying about the solutions or what we do. We're transparent. We're traders that made a system for traders, basically. And that's what this system is for all of you. So is it risk? No, it shouldn't be. Not for us. The risk is not whether or not it works. The risk for us is whether or not you work out. That's it. That's what it comes down to. Are you willing to work? That is the real risk. You could be, you should be considering something on your short, on your on your part. And definitely if the set to have but you don't say hey i just spent 147 dollars for the system now i need to 13 trades to get my roi this should never be considered part of your roi in a way okay. it shouldn't be the first and foremost part of your roi the money you put in nadex if you put 800 in the nadex right now this is the only money that you should be concerned about right now is following your risk management, how much you're risking per each one. Every time you put $80 down, right? That leverage is the only thing you should be worried about. Not the 147 from over here. But is there things to, to, to consider as you are learning through the process? I mean, if you're not getting it, if it's three or four months in and you're still kind of battling back and forth, or you're waiting for the other systems, I can see that. But if you're index indicators and you just can't figure it out, come and see us, talk to us, consult with us. This is what we do. We, we talk to you. I've had to tell a few people, hey, I don't think this is for you. I think you need to move over here or maybe just sit or not trading. I have to be honest with you because I don't want a conversation that you, you have when you call me and say, uh, I lost all my money. All right. Got it. Good. Now, money. The big thing about money in any of this system, okay, is that the risk management plan that you have only trading 10% or 5% you come up with, 10%, you know, $800 investment into the, the system, $80 per trade, you can only do one contract, right? That system's in you in training. This is not something you kind of alter on a daily, well, let me see, maybe I should do 8% today or... I'm going to do 50% because I really want to hail Mary this one because I need Christmas money. No, it's embedded to you like blinking, right? Try going not blink for a while. Yeah, all dry eyed. You go crazy, right? But the concept's embedded in you. And if it's not, back to the fucking drawing board. Because listen, without management embedded into your soul, you will lose. Ask anybody in there. Ask anybody in there who's done a Hail Mary. Uh, well, you know what? I just lost two contracts, so let me go in and do five now, see if I'll make it back. Screw you, you won't, because Murphy's Law will jump on board your head 
and think nothing, think nothing of the fact of taking all your money. Okay. Secondly, a part about the money is learning the management side of it. How do I grow it? Okay. Eight hundred dollars, great. I'm, when do I when do I put another contract on? Well, if you're trading an eight hundred dollar initial investment, right? We're not saying that you have to go do, but we're saying that this is a suggestion. And for this example, eight hundred dollars, and you're trading ten percent management, so you can trade eighty dollar contract, right? Eighty dollar risk contract. You're trying to make twenty dollars. Now, if you're doing twenty two or seventy eight dollars either side, doesn't really matter. What matters is that this is the average, right? So in this average of eighty dollars. You do one contract. If you do two contracts, you're trading a 10, 20% risk management. It's too much. You crazy? Four trades, you're done. Five trades, you're done. Got it? Okay, good. So every $800 increase to your balance is another contract. This starts to establish the V in your CVG. Got it? Sure hope so. Because those of you that are not following this are destined to fail. Yes, I know. My crystal ball is a little bit cloudy. All right. Okay. So management. Once you get to the pathway of CVG is down and it's okay and everything is great. Sorry for all the initials. But then you start your marks off every month, right? And this is where you skim off. I know it sounds really bad, but hey, that's what it is. All right, so let's just say you get to $8,000 in your account, right? You're doing 10 contracts a piece, right? Now you got to $8,000. How much money should you pull off at this point? Anybody in there can answer? From this $8,000, how much should you pull off? If your goal is 10 contracts down to trade, you want to trade 10 contracts all the time, how much money should you pull off of this $8,000? Ah, Rich, thank you very much. Got it right off the bat. Look at all you. You're paying attention. I love it. Quick. Nice, beautiful, you didn't fall for shit. Thank you, Rich, perfect. Michael, thank you. You don't pull off crap. Now, you get 12 grand in there at the end of the month. You wanna risk, you wanna do 10 contracts at a time. Now you can pull off your 4K, right? There's your money. There's your lovely money. Now that means that if you, if you really need eight, eight grand, you gotta kinda figure this out. You know, can you do 20 contracts? Yeah, but you know, I got to tell you, when's enough enough? You either got to learn to trade more or more time. You got to add more volume in contracts, 20, 30, 40 contracts for the people that do it. I try to stay around 10 because listen, how much more do I really need from the process? I don't have the time to put in, you know, a thousand contracts and sweat that shit over, over one, one thing. It's too big for me. The heavier that load, the more, you know? So you got to figure out how much do you really need. Yeah, tax man too. There's a lot of stuff in there for it's coming too for taxes here in the next week. All right, getting very close. And I do apologize. We're kind of running about five minutes over. Uh, listen, final thoughts. You're watching this after the fact. This is pretty important to you as well. All right, all of you down in the room. Promotions. You're going to see a lot of stuff come over. We're going to be offering deals all over the place. Don't feel put out if you if you if you missed a promotion from before we don't we don't retroact we don't go back and say okay now we're gonna have deck signals for 4255 we did that once right here's what happened we went back and gave every single customer we had at that time the 4255 or whatever it was, it was 87 bucks right we had jumped it to 127 prematurely we charged a bunch of people and we told people, you know, it's not fair that all these other people have 87, but we're going to get rid of the 27, bring it back. All those people that had paid the 127, we cycle back to the 87. It speaks volumes to our integrity. But you're going to see promotions out there. You're going to see two for one deals. Might, might, might see off to you, okay? But don't worry. If you see something out there, we'll try to match it as best as we possibly can, okay, within reason but you're gonna see some deals for some of our previous customers that were here that are gonna come over. All right, you'll hear about these. I don't, I don't believe in hiding this stuff, we're transparent. But it's to ask them to come over, ask them to come back. So we're gonna offer them a pretty sweet deal to do so. 
Okay, so they might get off a lot on their first month, but they'll be back up to full price, you know, right from the, from the get-go. Because this is your company, because this is your investing in this network, I'm telling you these things, but I also want you to know that this is going to happen. Because in the Christmas season and getting into the new year and getting customers, we need to get to 300 customers paying a month. Okay, this is what we need to get to. And we can do this. We can do this in January. We're very close. All right, so we're going to be offering a lot of our previous customers to come back and offering the Dex Trader. We're going to be asking all those button pushers to come back to get into Dex Trader. So you're going to see these things out there. For all of you that are paying full price 147 for any system that you have, you're going to get Dex Trader for free if you want to use it. If you don't, don't worry about it. You don't have to. You don't have to get it. Save us the time and energy and all the training you already like what you got. Great, love it. Right. If you want the button push, if you want the added extras, if you want the flash, you want the gash, you want it on your pad, you want it on your phone, those kind of things, go over and let us know and we'll get you up to full price and you get you get Dex Trader for free. All right, training. Some revamping training is coming. Some of the stuff in Trader's Mind, some of the stuff in uh, the Pro Signals, some of the stuff uh, in Intraday, okay, you've been lacking a little bit and I'm trying to get caught up, but you're going to see some training redone. There's going to be some new voiceover stuff. There's going to be some new videos in. We're going to try to let you know every new thing that comes out, but once in a while, we're going to say, hey, go back through all the train, go back through these training modules and see the new updated versions of these things and see what, if it helps you at all. If not, then don't worry about it, okay? Everything that I do, I put my heart and soul into. Same thing with Amy, same thing with Brian, same with some of the people that are in this room, okay? It takes hard work to get where you're going. Even though the Dex Trader is a button push, for some of those people out there, I don't want you to ever think that it's going to take away from the workload that needs to be done, from the discipline that needs to be handled. If you don't have that discipline, you need to go find it. And that takes hard work. I'm never going to give up and never going to give in to any of the things that happen in this world to keep me from making this a success. But guess what, folks? I am already there. I am already a success in my eyes. My family thinks I am. I think every there's a handful of people in here, too, and even more so in the network that are as well. You're a success because you found a pathway and you're on it, you're working it, okay? Second to last, the family and the holidays. Remember, these things sometimes go together like oil and water, right? During the holidays, keep an eye on the market. It becomes very fickle because not only do you have bad times with your family sometimes, and so do other people, and they trade sporadically, and everything goes haywire, and everything goes crazy. So keep that in mind. Holidays from a, right around the 12 days of Christmas all the way to the New Year's of New Year's becomes very crazy. Sometimes news will hit the market and everything else. So keep in mind, the algorithms don't take into consideration the craziness of holidays. All right. Overall for the year, we're coming up to our a full year of data here by February. And that information, you know, we get into our second year, our data is worth millions of dollars. Yeah, did I, did I forget to mention that? The data is actually worth money. <laughs> yeah, even your data that you're collecting right now and you're, and you're training what you do is worth money. Okay, all right, so we're on for the long haul. And that's what, for all of you that are watching and all of you that are in this room, it's not about today. It's not about tomorrow. It's not about next month or next quarter. Or maybe for some of you, it's not even about next year. What it is about is that you're on that pathway now. And from this point on, there's nothing that can get in your way. What you have learned is to strip back all that complicated bullshit that's out there. All those people that are trying to take your money, all those people that are trying to rip you off. From now on, if a company doesn't sound and act exactly like this, they are not worth your time or weight. Your time is the most important thing to you and to us. So we want to make sure that you're using it properly. Go through all the training, learn the process, learn the systems, associate with the traders, be a part of it, follow the training to a T, put your time in. This is not about getting your 147 a month. This is about earning yourself to that level of trading because it will get you to that point. And then that 147 becomes nothing but a drop in the bucket for what you're making every month. And do you keep the training from that point? No. If you have the signals and you're doing your own thing, yeah, absolutely. It becomes a, a necessity tool. Some people came and learned what not to do, and they move on. Some still, even from the beginning, we have some traders that are still very, very new into this process, but some that have been here since the beginning. All right. 
I want to thank all of you for the time. For those of you that are watching after the fact, please, please, please understand, I thank you so much for your time. It takes a lot of effort to get to these archives and make sure that you're watching. Thank you so much. Um, for everybody else in the chat room, hang out. we got questions and answers happening here in just a minute. I'm Max Fierro. This is Dex Signals. Thank you again, and trade well.